Welcome to Character Roulette. Each week, MBT and I will spin a wheel to build a deck from packs featuring cards used by anime characters throughout Yu-Gi-Oh's history. Then we'll craft one card of each rarity from our packs to round out our decks. After a character's pack wins the match, it's removed from the wheel while the losing pack is given a second chance at victory. Tune in every weekend for new episodes of the Yu-Gi-Oh! Character Roulette. I have made a severe and continuous lapse in judgment. I'm not here to expect your forgiveness, but I'm simply here to apologize. Bakura did not play the Labyrinth cards in the anime. Today we are here with Character Roulette, and we're making a couple changes based on your guys' feedback. I have removed Weevil from the wheel and replaced him with Siegfried. That was another pack that um, he really didn't have a ton of cards from the anime in there. It did have the Insect Queen stuff, but it also was Insectors and Battle Wasp. And then also we updated the Mako Tsunami pack with the one that MBT willed into existence. Furthermore, um, one change that has been requested a few times that I think we are finally going to make now is that you can't respin anymore, so that we do have to be forced to play with the worst characters and actually give them a chance. So without further ado, let's spin that wheel. You won the last one, this is for you. And there you go, uh, no respins, fuck you, you're playing Valkyries. Siegfried von Schroeder. So where was Valkyries. this guy in the anime? That's a great one. I've never heard of this guy in my life. Are you kidding me? Do you, no. Are you a fake fan? Is yes. that what we're learning right now? Yep, yep. Siegfried von Schroeder is the antagonist of the Kaiba Corporation Cup arc, which takes place between the Sea Livori Kalkos season and the oh, uh, final Battle duel City. season. Okay, it's, okay. It's filler. No, there's, there's an additional tournament that like Joey is set up to win, and then he loses to this guy, who it turns out is hacking the entire he tournament. He loses to, to Valkyries? What a Kaiba. loser. <laughs> Well, Valkyrie, okay, in this, the only interesting part about this entire season is that the Valkyries, the entire time, look like this huge, unbeatable series of cards. Like, legit, like, every single person who plays them loses in exactly one turn. Well, I hope I get Joey to combat that and have a lore-accurate matchup. Let's see what I get. Come on, Joey. Uh, that doesn't work. Oh, let's, let's hey, I th oh, I thought no respins. No well, respins. we're not going to, there's we not, there's not respin. two Siegfried. They could put one with like, you know, like the alt fighter. Okay. Didn't we're you already do harpies. I lost. Oh it stays God. on the wheel. Well, harpies versus uh, Siegfried. I mean, you guys wanted no respins. I'm sure this will go just okay. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. Good luck with those polls, man. So here is what dog does not know. This pack sucks balls. It's like really bad. <laughs> one of the worst. Okay, good start. Good start. Uh, this one, okay, so like there's not really anything we want at low rarity. Obviously, we want to max out on all the Valkyries. I guess maybe we want the Goddesses, but even Mischief of the Time Goddess, which is like the payoff, is SR. So Christ alive. Zvita is good, and Verdon's Guidance is one of them. Well, there's fucking Mischief of the Time Goddess. Did you know that this card was not in Edo Pro for like years after release? One of the hardest cards to code in the history of time. Do you want me to tell you how to pronounce the German names? You know, Waltzmaster, I think it's better if you don't. Uh, Goddess of Sweet Revenge. I mean, <laughs> I don't think we can make it happen twice. Aurora Paragon um, is a very interesting card. <sighs> No thanks. We're not FTKing here. Trias Hierarchica is, is, is a good card. Um, and there she is again. Brunhilda is Valhalla in this pack? It is not. No, it is. It's a fucking SR. Wow. This is not going well. There's not a way that it could go well. Are your Master Duel deck lists on Yu Gi Oh! Pro deck.com? They're not. Uh, if you type exclamation mark decks, you can get a list of all my decks, but they haven't been updated in a while, so maybe maybe I should put them on there. You should update it every time you top a YCS. Great idea. There's another Brunhilde. I mean, I like Treeborn Frog, but... You know, maybe not the time. Getting dicked down by a finals paper. Have to write 8 to 10 pages in 6 hours. Any words of encouragement or motivation? Stats got me fucked up, man. Um, just remember the number one rule of statistics. Actually, there are no rules of statistics. 
It's the bad boy of mathematical disciplines. All right, last pack. Can we end on a hollow? I'm feeling a little hollow. Gel and duo. Fucking hell. I think our win con right now is just to hope that marshmallow ass gel and duo gets us there. There's no way. This is. These are not the pulls we needed to do this. There's maybe a world in which we can do this, not with these pulls. All right, we're running it back with Harpies. I feel like our pulls last time were good, so we're gonna get punished here today. Now, maybe with the blue eyes stuff, you know, we had the completely different deck the second time around. This could be similar. We missed a lot of cards. You know, we did have a lot of good ones. I don't even know if we had Swallow's Nest or maybe I just missed it, but uh, no Hysteric Party. I feel like that's like the hardest card to pull in this pack. I rarely have pulled it. But um, Harpy's Hunting Ground should be pretty good in this matchup. You know, the Goddess Skull Oracle um, engine line just gets wrecked by Hunting Ground. But I think the Valkyrie stuff um, not only does have some win conditions, they do have a couple good cards, but also the generic fairy support in that set is not half bad. Spiritual Swords of Revealing Light! It's my turn to get MBT with this card. I will say, though, that the generic fairy support in the set is not bad. Alluring Mirror Split, pretty good. So if we low roll and he high rolls, it could be rough. Archlord Christia and Angel of Seven are in that pack and they are very powerful cards. And there are ways to uh, tribute some of them. There's like Angel O One, one I think in that pack too. Valkyrie. Grinning Grave Virus. Oh, Harpy Harpist. I don't think we had this one. With Hysteric Sign, it's a really good card, obviously, but I think we learned in that last match that it's not overpowered necessarily to search three cards in the end phase because it is pretty slow and also it almost seemed like i couldn't find three cards that were worth adding um maybe if we had the uh the channeler because then it gives you like the channeler and a discard for it but last time we didn't have channeler so harpy oracle these pulls are actually like really bad i don't know if you guys have noticed that these are like really really bad um so, first Egotist. Okay, Harpy's Pet Dragon. That's pretty cool. That's actually different. We did not have access to this card last time. Um, kind of like I predicted, very different pulls from the last Harpy pack, and also we get um, a free UR. This is actually like awful. Look at that. That's terrible. Um, I'm sure the next 10 will be much better. All right, baby. This one's got to pull it through. Come on. Let's go. Got to be good. Looks terrible. Looks really bad. Okay, I mean, this this pack is nice. That's our first Vierta. Okay, that's a damn good card. All right. Um, uh, the playset of Athena. Fuck you. I do like that Swamp Mirror. We'll probably play that. Awesome. Out of the pack. Our 12th Trios. Satellite Synchron. Yep. yep. We're going to have to craft Valhalla. But you know, the rough part is that um, Hecatrice is also in this pack and is also an SR. So seconds Vita. There's Azure Rune. I mean, Azure Rune is a good card. We are so fucking cooked, man. Uh, that's our third Zveta. I don't know. Dogfighter is huge. Maybe we'll play Dogfighter. There's another Chariot, another Brunhilde. That's our Brunhilde playset. Use one more Chariot here. It looks like we might walk away with playsets of all the uh, the common and uncommon ones. Uh, except for Ersta, who we have opened zero of. Hold the phone. Nah, no, Harpies. Out of the pack? Oh, you shouldn't have. Here's our third chariot. That's what we wanted was Necroworld Banshee. Thank you. Can we end on a hollow? Oh, we're ending on many hollows. Oh my god, at least four. Okay, neither of those cards do anything. Second Erda, that's good. Fourth Athena, die. Our first Drita. We didn't even get a UR in that. Thanks. The, the pack is not good. I can't believe we really pulled zero of that one common. That's crazy. Okay, 10 more packs. You are guaranteed. Hoping for Channeler, hoping for Duster, hoping for... I mean, all the URs. That's one of the good things about when you go into packs that have single archetypes is that all the URs are playable. Heartland Draco, actually not bad. 
Salem and Great Pyro Phoenix. Probably not usable. Second copy of Harpy Oracle. Looks like. I feel like, you know, I started whatever season of Saga where I first went into this pack. I really didn't know any of these cards. Playset of Harpy's Pet. See, this really is the Kaiba thing again. We're pulling completely different cards. But I've played it so many times now that I actually do a little bit understand the play pattern. Form change. Cyber Shield. Second copy of Harpy's Queen. Toon Terror. Um, and then Harpy's Pet Phantasmal Dragon, which ends up not really aging that well. I don't think that card's that good anymore. How about that? Pet Baby Dragon. Hysteric Party! Okay, we do see a Hysteric Party. These pulls are looking really bad so far. Like, even still, we're 15 packs in. Well, 14 packs in, technically. Maybe this is where it all turns around. Six more... Okay. All the Hollows are... Okay, Econ's pretty good. Yeah, this is not... This is not going our way today. This might actually be a fair-ish matchup if our pulls are this bad. But um, last five packs here, I'm sure this will be really good. You are from inside the pack. This is not the free one, by the way. Jura Ghetto's pretty good. Harpy Channeler! Let's go. No copies of a lot of the Harpy main deck monsters, though. We're missing, like, all the super rares except for Harpist. So, a little bit less good, but I'm sure, I'm sure it's fine. Sprite Red, we could summon that with um, Harpy... Cyber Slash Harpy Lady? Okay, we're kind of popping off now. Never mind. It really is all coming together with these last five pets. I mean, none of these are the free UR. The free UR is the very last pull of for the Secret Packs. So, suddenly we have a really good, like, baseline engine. A win condition, as they may say. But I don't even know if Cyber Slash Harpy is that good. That's how it works. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it's the last card in the packs. Cowboy! Cowboy! I just got banned. I got a message from Doug Zeep that I got banned from Konami. Okay, not only good for cowboying for game, obviously, if we get him to 800, but also good because it can attack, uh, well, it can crash with anything that's 3,000 or less. I mean, crash with a 3,000 attack over 29. You guys get it. But, yeah, that's, I like that. Not half bad. Final pack here. Let's see a different UR. Fabled! Harpy Conductor, pretty good. Harpy, okay, so three different URs, but I will say we are missing a ton of cards because we're only going to get one super craft and it's pro it has to be the what a, Harpy Perfumer. And that means that, you know, the only high rarity Harpy monsters we have are Channeler, Perfumer, and one Harpist. So this is going to be a deck. This is going to be a deck. Let's uh, get to building here. Oh, come on. Not like this. It does look damn good. I'm not going to lie. It does look damn good. All right. The deck's terrible. There, there's not too much we can do about that fact. The pack is just not very good. We've got some stuff in here. We've got... What the fuck is Telus doing in here? I actually... Oh, no. It, it is necessary. So the concept is like our little guys are like Telus, which is a bunch of tribute material for the big guys. Gelen Duo sticks around. Fierte's fine. Drita's fine. But we are playing a lot of level six or higher monsters. Trias Hierarchica hopefully can like make use of all these little things. And hopefully we'll just draw Final Light along with a bunch of our monsters. Uh, we do have all of the goddesses and mischief, which is funny, but I don't know if it's good. Um, I imagine we are just going to get stomped here. All right. Here's the deck. It looks okay. It is definitely worse than the deck that we had last week, but I think it's okay, especially against Valkyries. That being said, we did miss out on a lot of cards. I am a bit worried about bricking. Hopefully the Swallow's Nest and the uh, Alluring Mirror Split does get us to the uh, either the Harpist, the Perfumer, or probably Channeler, and then that should unlock like our better combos. But honestly, I think this could lose to Valkyries. I am a little bit worried. Let's hope it doesn't, though. Our crafts today are going to be Perfumer and Channeler. We don't need any common or rare crafts. We pulled three copies of all those cards so let's craft these let's pull a royal rare one of these days it'll happen uh not today let's jump to the duels though and see how it goes yep this hand doesn't really do anything we'll activate harpy queen let me get it in the character oh i guess i could do uh, all i could all in for that we'll go alluring mirror split I guess his hand does a little yep. something now that I think. Wait, whoa, whoa, where does this summon from? Oh, the hand doesn't do anything. <laughs> well, it like minus threes into slash, I guess. 
Is that even good? Don't worry, Herr Douglas. I will make this fast for you. Yeah. yeah. That's the kind of shit Siegfried von Schroeder is saying. Yeah, what's his what's I his what type of guy is he? Man. What? What type what type of dude is he? He's a cheater, but like what what is he like? What does he like? Oh yeah, so if you're unfamiliar, Siegfried von Schroeder is like this tall slender kind of guy oh. who speaks in in he's a little like he's a little zesty he's a little fruity um and he has this like strangely colored hair um what color that it's almost pleated it's uh it's pink and oh. i know what you're thinking that's pegasus but i say that kind of sounds <laughs> Uh, the character looks almost exactly like Pegasus. So okay. to differentiate him, he's an he echo has a fighter. German accent. Pegasus. Oh sure, yeah, that's a big. You know, you make um, you change him from like high voice to high voice German. Yeah. Okay. Nice. I mean, I'm. Oh shit! What? It could, it could be worse. What? Be worse. Go ahead. <laughs> Those are probably just all goddess skull oracle. God. I see by way of your harpy queen that you have a fascination with the beautiful women as well. That's the type of shit he would be saying. Be like, <laughs> fuck off, my guy! You are so fucking annoying. It was the drop. <laughs> oh my god, dude. <laughs> A Douglas Zeef, you <laughs> fucking asshole! You well, it's setting you up for Goddess of Sweet Revenge, so... No, you didn't, because you put a card in my hand! <laughs> what are oh, wait. these? Wait, suck my dick, dude. I forgot this is waking the dragon. You Lotus must be flame. sucking my penis, Douglas! Okay, what could... Hey, that's not a Valkyrie card, so this won't trigger. Mm, I'm seeing none of these cards actually contest this Cyber Slash. You didn't have to set the fi the both final lights. No way. Unless well, I didn't expect to get Harpy's Feather Duster. Unless you do have got maybe you do have Goddess Spear Revenge. Hmm, it's time for you <laughs> to say hello to my beautiful ladies. Swarm to the field, Valkyries Vita. This a German girl will kill your happy lady. Die! Wait, I'm dead. Is... I on. told you, Mr. Zeef, you will be sucking my penis. <laughs> it's like <laughs> I minus so hard on turn one that. No, it's fine. It's fine. It's actually totally fine. Yeah. It's good. You shut the fuck up. You have alluring mirror split. Yeah, I, there's no, nothing it's, I it's can do there. about it. It's this. hanging in there. It's hanging in there. Oh, I see you have unt ultra rare. Mm -hmm, After mm -hmm. having unt additional ultra rare card <laughs> in hand and in extra deck. Yeah. How yeah. interesting, Douglas. <laughs> Perhaps I am not the only one who is hacking the computer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. All right. This okay. is actually. Oh, good. You know and what? Now you can put cyber slash. On That's second really thought, cool. this is not that bad. Although, really, I'm still gonna be on like two cards when you think about it um i guess i will activate this yeah sure it's a not bad draw it's pretty good someone um, is checking this man's pc <laughs> this is very not normal <laughs> I'm, I'm turning from 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 the uh the like slightly fruity gay man into a little like a pudgy german a little boy. german boy <laughs> yeah <laughs> oh my god there is the three happy ladies on this card Ooh, okay. All Why right. is it part Crowler? I mean, I is you know, Crowler's kind of Pegasus too when you think about it. They just couldn't get away from that archetype. Okay. Okay. Go ahead. Now I'm not gonna fall for your tricks here. I see the I see the T set. That's a pretty good draw. Yeah. Um, like activate effect. What? What the fuck? Yeah. This card can special summon itself. Wait, are you kidding me? Didn't know. There we go. Oh my god, he does not know his own card in. <laughs> okay, the little angel. What what does I'll this do on a, I will be getting a fucking token. Oh, okay. I thought that was, I mixed that one up with the Angel 01, I think, a lot. 
but I didn't realize that it gets a token. Okay, go ahead. Um, this is not fucking good. Yeah, no. Uh, I mean, the, the Logis Flame for Zaborg was not bad. But... Let's see you defeat my goddess, Erdvardik. Once we're changing to clear ones. Okay, sure. Okay. <laughs> oh my god, this is not good. <laughs> I am beset on all sides. Yeah, I mean, I get, you know, this is what the people wanted, right? We're not playing Insector Weevil. This is what had. This is the only possible pack that could have replaced Weevil. So, you know, it. I just want to. Right, let's 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 run it back. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. What happened was, you know, I put this in the comment, I think, but it really was the tenth player was either going to be. Wow, this deck actually can draw pretty well. the The tenth player was either going to be Bakura or Valkyrie, right? So it is what it is. But I'm sure Valkyrie will get in there eventually. You just got to give it a couple times. Um, it's it's really cool that like um. I can theoretically lose this game and then roll Valkyrie again next week. That's like really enjoyable. Yeah, no, about. that's that's really. I mean, that that's great. You know, that's that's really good. Um, I am. I will say, I am really, I'm really glad we're doing this because those labyrinth games, the labyrinth harpy games, they were like a little too interactive. Like we got into <laughs> unfortunately too many interesting board states. Yeah. And I, the whole time I was just thinking, what if you were playing against? Uh, functionally, just an AI bot. What if you were just w wailing on a child? I think it. I think that. Board? Okay, but hear me out. Wouldn't that episode have been so you much? Stop opening this exact fucking hand. This is the <laughs> third week in a row I have played against this exact hand. What? How okay. Wouldn't possible? that episode last week have been way cooler if it was hunting ground popping destiny board all three games? I think that would have been pretty epic, personally. I mean, that would have been awesome, and I think it would have been good TV, and I think that. You know, the crazy thing is that uh, Dark Magician Blue Eyes, uh, Dark Magician Girl, uh, um, I don't want to do this. It would have been more funnier? Is that, I don't think more funnier is a thing. Uh, Hold up. This is an interesting hold. one. So we go. See, we'll get a token. Here. Triggers tell us the little angel. Yeah. Then we can activate tell us the little angel. Oh, what does this do? Special summon. We banish a spell from our hand. That's right. We minus even further. <laughs> we summon two tokens. From here, okay. we summon Chaos Angel. <laughs> mm hmm. This is where you write Geki me. Oh, I can't believe I get to do this twice. twice. Oh, no way. Really? That that is Loge's flame face down. It is Loge's flame. Actually, kind of uh, fucked up. Yeah. Does it? What is the on field effect of that card? Oh, he's uh, banished. It's, it's gravity bind, actually. Oh shit. It, it nice. is a card you would have to out eventually. Yeah, no, that is true. Well, I actually don't have a lot of outs to that. Well, okay, never mind, never mind, never mind. Never mind, never mind. <laughs> I mean, you just play the game. Wait, I'm actually. Uh... I should have done this for... Okay, okay, okay. I'm actually a little bit worried. I'm a little bit worried. I'm a little bit worried. Let's, uh... No, this I this has to like sack into something. I'm going to be honest. This has to see something. Uh-oh. What do oh, you have? Oh, little Douglas. I will now fucking you up. Oh, that set card isn't Hysteric Sign, is it? God... Uh, Fuck around and find out. <laughs> yeah, we will find out. First, we will draw und card. Oh, oh my god, that card is fucking terrible. <laughs> Alright, that was a little too Italian. We activate <laughs> the effect all of sorts of... Oh my god. Wait, we you could do the fucking... Fairies. We, we will be summoning this card and destroying your back row. And in sequence, we will be drawing two... Yes, get your last stupid fucking card. It's... Oh, that is... Oh, wait. I can't beat this card. 25 defense. Uh-oh. <laughs> I really can't out that. Fuck. Um... You ever watch... Uh... I don't think he had a German accent. Do you ever watch Kids Next Door growing up? Yeah, yeah. 
Wasn't there like, remember that guy, that that little pudgy kid that was like ex obsessed with candy? Or it was like a oh, Egyptian. Yeah. Was he German? I feel like he might have been. Turned out to be a girl. Yeah, that was the. What? You know what? Yeah, yeah. You don't know anything about kids next door lore. I, I mean, I watched like every episode as a kid, but I don't remember. Okay. Okay. I will be summoning <laughs> Valkyrie Vierte. Oh uh, shit! Do you speak in the Deutsch at all? <laughs> Wait, this is actually getting out of hand. Yeah, Vierte means. What does this mean? Green. She's green. I it's green. I mean, green hair, green background. It might as well mean by green. Closing, by using the 10 gigabyte dueling feature. <laughs> I am zooming in on the card and seeing her face looking like how to draw anime. <laughs> oh my god, we did not get shit. <laughs> Wait. And we have nothing to go into. Wait, why did it only reveal one card? Oh. This deck is so bad. <laughs> you can't out to 25. God. Fuck, dude. I can't. <laughs> oh, keep drawing your shitty card. <laughs> Ooh, not so strong without synchro, are you, dumb fuck? <laughs> oh! Uh oh. Well, guess what, dumbass? This is this is once per turn. Hold up, what? wait. I can even do better. <laughs> what does this card do? Nothing. Uh, okay, it does it it does a little something. A uh, happy lady. Okay, I can be <laughs> normal summoning. Valkyrie, uh, Svite uh, number two no! is coming out again. Wait, uh, yeah. Zayborg, the uh, a shitty monarch. Okay, no, that's a little scary. sent a Vin Ving beast to the grave. I do not give an unfuck. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, wait, this is actually quite strong. Please don't uh, have the double battle phase combo right now. Okay, then we have to find me a mischief of the time goddessen, please. <laughs> Kill this white Oh bastard. no! Holy shit! What Wait, the fuck? That's a continuous spell, right? A quick play spell. You can't add oh it. Oh my god, it's a quick play! I am so fucking bad! Why oh, my deck! It is not good! I remember going to this pack and I was like, why do all these cards like purposefully anti synergize with each other? I have been winning in a board state for six turns and it does not matter. Uh, Holy shit. It might shit. matter. It might matter. <laughs> me, me adding another fucking ultra to hand. Oh, maybe this time, little German <laughs> boy. All right, let's summon this. How, how in the fuck is this deck still on the wheel? <laughs> <This is> <laughs> the labyrinth pack. It's too good. Oh, the commenters, they were right. <laughs> I should never have doubted them. Oh my god, dude. Um, okay, okay. I mean, you drew like six cards. That was pretty good. I did not draw any cards! What? I used Vieta twice and drew nothing! No, the the, the, tr the, tra anything. the Trias guy, didn't that draw like three cards? It, it drew me two cards. You are right. You oh, are two right. cards, two cards. Okay, okay. Um, yeah, well, yo, let's summon this. Let's, uh, let's pop this. Uh, yeah, oh, I mean, nice I guess pop, this is good. You stupid bitch. <laughs> Fuck, do you get the, you get the pet dragon thing? Oh, you get, get, you the, get the pet get dragon? Hoppy lady. No way. This no. card does nothing. Pop your own hunting ground, stupid bastard. <laughs> don't know a goddamn thing. Now why is it so bad, Mario. though? Like, that's what I want to know. Like, why do they... Valkyrie? Uh, no, the, no, no. why is hunting ground mandatory? Oh, because it was made in 2001. True. Um, alright, let's go battle. Attack. Oh, uh, I bet you are very excited to be... Oh my fucking god. <laughs> I... Th I don't... Am I dead here? I... Th maybe? I better not be. 20... I don't think so, I don't think so. Even with this boost, I don't think so. Go this. Jesus Christ. 15. No, you should be good. You're fine. Fine, he says. You're yeah, yeah. Proc the RP just, late, just RP hard fine. Base, just fine. Just fine. Holy fine. shit. And you draw two cards? Awesome. Well, you know, you drew two Dude, cards. I got to draw two. RP hard base. <laughs> See, it's great. That better not be fucking Icarus attack. That's all I gotta say. If that is right, fucking right, Icarus, right. that better not be a fucking Icarus attack. 
You're good. Why am I restricted to only wind monsters right now? Oh! <laughs> Got something uh, cooking? That does not do. That does not do a god. A goddamn thing. Fuck. He just needs to draw Valkyrie circular. Yeah, true. We begin. We fall. Hala, hala, Wait. Okay. This fala. could actually. That can fuck me up a little bit. Activate and the effect. Yep. Valkyrie Brunhilde. This big ass bitch. It's going to kill your stupid ass <laughs> monsters. Oh wow. my I mean, god, if that card is fucking Icarus attack, I will be so mad. I it's not. You will not hear the end of it. It's not. I will normal summon Viette, which you un ungracefully put back in my hand, you, you asshole. Yeah, maybe you should. You well, see, I didn't want to put the other guy back in, because, yeah, if you had so the Valhalla, you could just pop. <gasps> oh my god! The game is over, you stupid bastard! What? I activate Ride of the Valkyrie! Royal Rare! <laughs> Come to the field, my beautiful women! Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> Oof, I am nothing! Why am I at so- Where'd my attack points go? The same place your life points are going, silly Billy! Alright, that's pretty good, that's pretty good. Don't next! I will be adding from my deck to my hand the oh. mischief of the time goddess. Oh, oh my yes. god. Um. Get the fucking there. Kill this white bastard. <laughs> so you just yesterday, you were joshing me about this card. You know what I pulled this week, Joseph? Spiritual swords. <laughs> That is uh, very annoying, <laughs> uh, I must admit. Yeah, I am no, a little that's... pissed off about that uh, shit. Fuck! Although... Oh, my God. With the second battle phase... It is time for you to get uh, fucking timed on. So, why does this card say send it to the grave? Like, why does it say that? It's, it's going to go to the graveyard anyway. Shut up! You don't know shit! <laughs> you are a very big dumb asshole! Um, yeah, I mean, I guess we'll protect it again. I guess you will, won't you? Oh! Oh, there is just no fucking way it works like that. Skip to the start of battle phase of your next turn so I can use once per turn effects again? Oh my god, I am so fucking mad about that. Is that is not how I thought that would work. I, I okay, I I don't care anymore. This does not matter. Perhaps <laughs> it will matter to you. Oh, Vierte. from your deck. Uh, uh, huh. I wonder if you had done that in your other battle phase to get two activations. If yes, that I been would have won. I am. <laughs> yes, I am very. I am not very smart. Uh. And for some reason, it is a once per turn. Uh, yeah, yeah. Oops. <laughs> Valkyrie cards, you know. Okay, I, I think I actually still win the game. Oh, my God. Um, <laughs> by special summoning a Valkyrie, Erda. Oh, again? Yeah. I can get the fucking... I do lose still. That is correct! Right? You cannot defeat my beautiful Okay, if I let this go woman. through, it's 11, and then this one can attack over for... Well, wait. It'll go to 11. Oh, this one isn't based on how many monsters I have. If I do this, I go to... Wow, you actually did win. You actually did get it. <laughs> you fucking stinky man. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe it. How were Valkyries the first deck to legitimately take us to game three? How is that even possible? Oh, this does not look very good. This one, I do not see <clears throat> this one. Is Maybe you'll get harpies next week. No, I'm gonna. I Maybe got. Maybe you one, will get out of my fucking hair. How about that? <laughs> no, this hand, this hand looks all right. Oh, it's actually kind of annoying that I do that. Um, two back row. Uh, uh -huh. You know, I've learned my lesson. I I think I'm gonna stop randomly popping back row. I think we're not doing that anymore. Oh, I'm I'm so I'm so uh, happy that 
you know, I have figured out a mechanism to counterplay uh, your fucking harpy's feather duster. Yeah. Oh, you drew perfumer? Is that what happened? Yeah, yeah. I, I mean, I'm not going to complain, you know, it's... <laughs> oh, yes, you are. I know you are. You yeah, yeah, I did. do like complaining quite you a bit. You already did. <laughs> oh, nice deck, dude. Whoa, this is so cool. It, I mean, it's... <laughs> yeah, it's not bad. It's not lethal. So the Loge's Flame only works if you control a harp or a, a Valkyrie, right? That is correct. I actually will try to not take as much damage here. Um, oh, okay. On a light effect, light fairy, right? I mean, yeah. And then we tributed for the Trias Hierarchica. How crazy that's fine. Is that shit? That's fine. Um, <clears throat> I will continue the attack. We'll take that out. Shaisa. Why are you freaking out? Um, okay, 22. Mm-hmm. Hey, fuck. Oh, son of bitch. Okay, Jeez. that is very bad. Yeah, so it would have been lethal, but no, you had the... You had that? You had that? Let's go Harpist. Fucking shit, man. I'm sure it's fine. Are you? Okay. I'm not particularly sure. I think... We're gonna go these two into slash. Oh, don't think too hard about it, my good friend. And then I'm actually gonna use these two for a card I have not revealed yet. Baguska. <laughs> Fuck, <laughs> that is not okay. Uh, yeah. You are. Not oh, quite wow. Baguska. This doesn't even feel that strong. I feel like you could come back from this. I mean, Valhalla plus anything, like, I don't have a spell or trap, right? So, you know, maybe not. <laughs> I guess you got to deal with a couple cards. Or was that the second the second channeler I just saw? I haven't yeah. seen that yet. Second yeah. channeler there? Well, last right. week I didn't have any, so I thought this week... Um, oh, oh, no, actually, so our, I'll tell you this. Our pulls were terrible up until the final five packs where we got channeler... And then Duster, and then Slash or something. Like, all three in a row. So, got a little... Oh. Okay. Fair. Oh, my God. This has happened. You took a game off me. That's... I mean, that's pretty impressive, I'm going to say. Oh, no. <laughs> Not as a cowboy. That's let me, a joke. Let me see your Valkyrie deck. Let me see... I what the fuck you hoping to see? <laughs> three of everything with Christia? No, it's, no, it's fucking nothing. We we actually pulled so poorly that we we pulled an out of pack you are in the first ten, and then no you are in the second ten. <laughs> That's horrible. It, it's as bad as the deck could be. Any copies of Angel O One or no? No. You got Treeborn I, I Frog. I think we pulled like one copy of Angel O One. I just didn't want to play him. That's fair. One oh, sorry, let me rephrase right. that. Of our super pulls, we got four Athena. Oh, that well, cool. that could have FTK'd me. Could it have? Yeah. Could've. Perhaps it is unlikely that that could have happened. Yeah. We did craft, our UR craft was the ride, and I was very happy to. It's a cool royal. Like that. No, that's a cool royal. You'll have to play royal. Valkyries on the channel now. Um, he did have Goddess Game when you, when you dusted. No way! Really? Oh, okay. So, yes. The reason I set the whole hand was yeah. because I wanted to get it all popped and then Goddess. But you bounced the uh, the Telus instead of walking over See, it. See? I was playing around it. I, I knew. Were... I've done it. I've done it. Okay. Uh, see you guys next week. No more Harpies. They're gone. They're gone.
And then it just, it does more. I, I'm not going to do the whole thing. 